Pillars are a key component of most hardscape projects, and with Yukara, constructing them is quick and easy. The base for a pillar is prepared much the same as for a wall, only deeper. We recommend a minimum of 12 inches of clear stone below the base pad. Before construction, install electrical conduits and or irrigation lines where required. Always observe local, state, and national building codes. The easiest way to construct a base pad for a Yukara pillar is by installing four universal base units in a square. Pillars require a minimum of two courses of backer blocks below the finished grade for stability. Although fascia panels are not required below grade, they will provide additional stability for the pillar assembly. Refer to your plan to determine the total height of your pillar and calculate exactly how many large SureTrack backer blocks you need. You will need four large SureTrack backer blocks for every six inches in pillar height. Use a three inch chisel and two pound mallet to remove the front top key of each SureTrack backer block. Begin by marking the exact location for the first backer block on the base pad. Using concrete adhesive, glue the square of four large SureTrack backer blocks onto your base pad. Use a square to ensure perfect alignment of the group of blocks. Now glue the next square of the four backers onto the top of the first layer of backers. Be sure to log cabin each course of backers by placing them in the opposite direction. To create an additional SureTrack rail on the side of the backer block, simply snap in the plastic SureTrack insert as shown here. Every couple of courses, it's useful to hang the Yukara fascia panels. This makes it easier to square and plumb the pillar as you go along. Be sure to use closed end fascia panels for this purpose. Left and right corner fascia panels will create a log cabin appearance. Consider straddling layers of the backer block when placing Yukara fascia panels to provide additional structural integrity. After hanging the final set of fascia panels and double checking alignment, you're ready to place a pillar cap on top of the pillar. The Yukara system is designed with 6 inch high backer blocks and panels, and with the Yukara 14 inch deep coping, it's easy to construct practical, safe, and comfortable steps. Steps always must be constructed on a base pad. Begin by installing the leveling pad for the first step by taking into consideration the final elevation. Use large Yukara SureTrack backer blocks to construct the main step riser. Apply concrete adhesive between the base pad and the backer block for strength and easy block positioning. For maximum step strength, glue the Yukara panels to the front of the backer blocks. Remove the rear top keys to allow the coping to seat properly onto the backer block. Depending on the coping type, you may have to remove both keys. For maximum safety, apply liberal amounts of adhesive to attach the coping unit to the backer block step tread. If the coping has a channel, adjust the overhang to align with the front key. An overhang of one and a half to two inches is recommended. To prevent the coping from slipping out of alignment, Allow for 20 to 30 minutes of adhesive curing time before building the next step. Backfill each step with open graded gravel and use a hand tamper to ensure there are no voids. Level another row of leveling slabs directly behind the first step assembly. These slabs should sit flush to the top of the backer blocks. This will achieve a six inch rise in the step. Once again, apply adhesive on the base pad and begin placing large backer blocks onto the pad allowing just enough room to hang the next Yukara fascia panel between the backer block and the coping. The adhesive under the backer blocks will allow you to easily slide the backer block and panel assembly up to the coping of the previous step. Repeat this process for each additional step. If your step has an exposed end, simply treat it as you would a wall corner by attaching a panel to the side of the large backer block. No matter what style of step you design, build it easily with Yukara. Building landscape features such as grill islands and fireplaces is similar to building vertical planters and walls, except that they are generally higher and require no backfill. Most vertical features can be constructed using Yukara standard backer blocks, which are light and easy to handle. The depth of the standard backer block combined with the depth of one Yukara panel creates a very manageable 8 and 3 8 inch deep wall. 
This is perfect for constructing hollow structures such as grill islands and fireplaces and provides sufficient space to access utilities. Spacing backer blocks horizontally can significantly reduce or sometimes completely eliminate backer block cuts. To save time and to avoid making unnecessary cuts, always try to design within the dimensions of the Yukara panel size. Features that are higher than four courses should always be constructed on a reinforced concrete slab to prevent settlement. To create a solid vertical structure, always glue each row of standard backer blocks to the previous row. Yukara is the perfect wall when you need to create access panels in your features like this fire feature. By placing backer blocks strategically, you can easily create a convenient access portal. And finally, Yukara facial panels can be used as a narrow format coping for small planters, fire pits, and countertop edging. When it comes to building landscape features, Yukara is practical, efficient, and versatile. For more detailed information on building with Yukara, North America's most advanced landscape wall system, download the Yukara installation manual from unilock.com or contact your Unilock representative.